Hey guys and welcome back to another makeup tutorial. So to start off with the eyes I'm going to start off with a transition shade. This is to kind of map out the reverse cat eye look that we are creating today. So going with this light brown shade I think it's called soft cream and I'm placing that along the inner corner, outer corner wing and also through the crease and just also blending out that line so it's nice and soft through the crease. Next I'm going in with a darker shade. This is Puta from the Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette on that same angle brow brush and I'm placing that on the same points that we applied the previous brown shade and also blending that along the crease area with a pencil brush. Next we're going with a deeper shade, I believe this is Mocha from the Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette. I'm placing that again along the same points that we placed the previous two brown shades and again <laughs> blending it out with a pencil brush keeping it a little bit tighter to that line so everything's nice and soft and blended and there's a nice gradient effect. I also go back in with the previous brown shades to soften up any harsh lines or edges. Then I'm taking my liquid liner from Tarte, this is the brown liquid liner, and I'm placing that along the inner point, along the bottom lash line, and along that outer corner wing to deepen it up a bit more. Then taking Central Park from the Jaclyn Hill palette, I'm placing that over top of that liquid liner and just kind of deepening it up a little bit more. I also go in and smoke it out a little bit and clean it up with some concealer. This is the Too Faced Born This Way concealer in the shade Cream Puff. Just to neaten everything up so it's nice and crisp and defined. And I also bring that through the crease area. Next, taking Cloudy and Beam. These are two different shadows, but they create such a gorgeous kind of soft champagne-y pink. I'm placing that all along the lid space from inner to outer corner. Then I go in with lashes. These are the Hannah's Beauty Box Cosmetic Lashes in the shade Pleasantly Plump. And they create such a nice, like, wispy effect to the eyes. For lips today, I'm going in with my Espresso Eye Coal, but I use it as a lip liner to kind of map out the shape of my lips and give a bit of like an ombre effect. Then I go in with the Zueva Pale Plethora Liquid Lipstick over top. And then to finish off, I'm going in with Dream Bubble from Hannah's Beauty Box Cosmetics, which is a beautiful clear lip gloss. And it just really creates such a gorgeous kind of glossy effect to the lips. And that is the finished look today. I hope you guys enjoyed. I really love this for like a glam night out kind of look. Let me know what you think. Would you rock a reverse cat eye? <laughs> Let me know. Love you all so much and I can't wait to see you in my next video. Bye.